Hi, this is Munson from Munson Music, and we're going to talk about how you can strum through an old tune called Rockin' Robin by Bobby Day. And I'm going to be working off the Bobby Day version, but if you want to play along with Michael Jackson, or the Jackson 5 version, what you want to do is capo on 7th fret, and it will be almost exactly the, the same thing. Um, so if we, we're going to be starting on a G major chord, and the way you play G major, first finger is going to go to the A on the 2nd fret, 2nd finger is going to go to the low E on the 3rd fret, and the 3rd finger is going to go to the high E on the 3rd fret. And if you strum all those together, that sounds a G major chord and it sounds really, really happy. And then from G major, we're going to be going to a C major chord. And the way you play C major, first finger is going to go B string on the first fret, second finger on the D on the second fret, and third finger on the A string on the third fret. And if you strum all those together, that makes a C major chord and it sounds really, really happy. And then from the C major chord on our intro, and our intro actually is probably the most difficult part of the song. Um, we're going to be going to a D major chord, but we're going to use all these chords later on in the verse and the chorus. And the way you play D major, first finger is going to go G on the second fret, second finger is going to go to the high on the second fret, and the third finger is going to go to the B string on the third fret. And with D major, you want to strum just the top four strings, just D, G, B, and E, kind of get the clear sound. And that's called D major, it sounds really, really happy. But on our intro, we kind of have the G major, da, 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 and then C major, D major, G major, C major, D major, G major, C major, D major, and then we do a G with kind of a down, 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 down. And what I like to do with that part is I'm kind of just taking my right hand and kind of killing the string. So I'm going down, down, kill it, down, down, kill it. But a lot of times to make that, that more interesting, a lot of times I like adding what I call a strum pattern to it. And one of my favorite strum patterns for a 4-4 four, four like this is down, down, up, up, down, up. So we took the G and just tried that all. You have down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, through the song, but on the intro part, <laughs> what we're going to be doing, uh, the weird part is we're going to take C and kind of half it and do down, down, up, and then the D and the down, down, up. So we're going to be half in those two chords, doing C with the down, down, up, D with the down, down, up, C with the down, down, up, D with the down, down, up. So we try that through our intro part, we have the G with the down, down, up. there we're going into our verse. Now in the recording it sounds like there's just kind of the, the, the down killets on the verse. So one way to do the verse would be the G G G G so that would be one way to do your verses, would be just doing that down kill it on it. Now if you want to fill that in with the strum pattern, um, then you'd be doing that whole strum pattern on the G down, down, up, up, down, G down, down, up. kind of kill it or you can do the strum pattern all the way through <laughs> so kind of options on that um so just try the, that strumming again you got the g down down up, down down
exactly just, just a straight 12 bar blues form, which this song is really close to. You got that G down, down, up. again so just to do that with the kill it thing you got D, da, 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 G, 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 and then you'd be picking it back up on the course again C, C, G, Again, so we got the G, 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 and then we're back to the chorus on the C down. coming back for, for our outro where we got the G down up, up down C down basics of how you could strum through Rock and Robin by, by Bobby Day or if you want to play along with Michael Jackson like I said just capo on seventh fret and you could use exactly the same arrangement so good luck <laughs>